A startup with a lofty goal keep a drone in the sky for days, weeks, maybe forever. Well, their success could change the world. KPI X5 Skid Doe shows us they're hoping to achieve it by borrowing some energy saving tricks that have been around forever. We are heading up to Emeryville to check out a startup called Kraus Hamdani Aerospace, where they are making some lofty claims about a perpetually flying drone that could soon stay in the sky forever. How do we know that that's just not science fiction talk? We have the engineers, we have the science, and we, we do know what we're doing. <laughs> Tony Stark, eat your heart out. Typical drones in this size and weight category can fly for about five hours, but this, this is no ordinary drone. The team has been steadily increasing flight times, and now they're up to 26 hours. Do you think that we will see a perpetually flying drone in the sky in your lifetime? By the end of this year, you will. So by 2022, absolutely. Let me show you around. Co-founder Stefan Kraus gives us a tour of their Bay Area headquarters. The office is part manufacturing floor. This is called the K-1000 Ultra Long Endurance Aircraft. Part R&D. It's very specially designed to be extremely rigid and weigh almost nothing. With a good dose of mad scientist and maker lab thrown in. This is basically like my own child. This is for me, this is everything. How do they do it? First off, the drones are big but light. 16 feet across but only weigh about 30 pounds. Since there's no landing gear, the drones launch from a vehicle and they land on these cheap 3D printed skids. Yes, skids, and come to a scraping stop. Solar panels recharge the batteries, but the secret sauce is in the artificial intelligence. Onboard sensors scan for thermals, rising pockets of hot air, and shuts off the power to the blades, which folds back to reduce drag. The autopilot then glides the drone around, riding those thermals to save energy. Co-founder and CEO Fatima Hamdani says they got their idea from Mother Nature. So we looked at birds, birds that fly long distances. They're not constantly flapping their wings. We are constantly monitoring environmental conditions algorithmically then feeding that back into the autopilot. Flying autonomously for days or weeks at a time means they can one day conduct long-term surveillance or search and rescue operations, establish radio or cell phone towers in the sky, even conduct climate change research, and, perhaps most urgently, monitor wildfires in real time 24 hours a day. Persistent assets that are flying non-stop, fully autonomously, most cost-effectively and efficiently can change how we do disaster management. It seems like an audacious thing to say that drones, flying robots, are going to change the world. It's a contribution. All of us are drops in the ocean that contribute to changing the world. Kitto, KPIX5.